Almost 2,000 subs. I've got to go, Matt. See you. Have a good one, Color Zing. Almost 2,000 subs. Let's go. That's hype. Uh, my goal is like 170-ish lean and muscular. Dude, you can do it. And you don't even have to put a time, like a time reference on what you want to do. You could just do it, bro. You could just do it and you could say, I want to do it one day. Um, <laughs> I dream to be six foot. Nez, listen, we can like lift you up or give you a ladder, right? See, like, therefore, like I could increase your height technically. I'll just send you a ladder to your house. Um, In Canada, I don't know how the shipping works from uh, Louisiana to Canada, but good luck with that one. Um, hi, I'm back. Welcome back, Chase D. We're just talking about goals. I have to go. Zay it out. Outro music plays. Dude, that I, I'm like mentally cringing. Um, anyways, this guy just played an outro to leave the stream. Listen, okay, that's a new rule. Rule number seven: Do not outro my streams, bro. Are you one of those guys that leaves a card and says Zay it out and just starts playing like na 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 na? You're weird, bro. Do not do that. All right, anyways, um, what other rules will we have? Yeah, there's not many other rules. Um. My goal is 150 subs and I'm at 109. Dude, that's a great, but I haven't posted in a bit. Just never had time. You say that, bro. So something I did actually today. I said, okay, right? I get 24 hours in the day, right? Let me subtract eight for sleeping. Okay, boom. What do you end up? Chat, we're going to do some math here, okay? I know you guys, you didn't come in here to learn math, but um, I'm going to teach you, okay? So you guys, if there's anything that you do in your life and you say you don't have enough time, let me show you. Watch this video. Share this video with your friends, okay? 24 hours in the day, right? You can say, all right, you sleep eight hours, right? Which you probably don't, but we'll say you sleep eight hours. Okay, you're at 16. All right, I don't think I don't think you guys have jobs, right? We'll go we'll go off my schedule. I have a job, right? So let's say I worked seven hours this morning. Boom, so minus seven. I got nine hours left. Okay, what am I doing with nine? Well, you know, I gotta I gotta stream, so that's minus an hour. I gotta eat, sleep, shower, not sleep. I'm sorry. I gotta eat and shower, so that's three meals. Uh, maybe two showers. So I don't know. We could say that's that's another. Sure, that's another. We'll say two hours just to lowball it. And then that's six hours. We'll say I work out two hours a day. Let's subtract two hours. So I got like four. I got four hours, and that's with everything. You know what I mean? I might be. I might. I could edit enough things in four hours, right? Anyways, and uh, I'm a busy person. And I have a busy day. So I don't know what your day looks like specifically. But you guys break your day down. And like, if you ever think you don't have time for something, bro. You have time for it, and you can accomplish it so easily. Um, I need it. My goal is to set... Wait, you need what? Wait, Nez, what do you need? Uh, my goal is to get to 600 subscribers. You can easily do that. Just keep posting your reaction videos. Keep going hard. What are you at now, by the way, Moon? Probably my goal is to get my driver's license. I hate math. You don't have it yet? Aren't you 18? Yo, what? It's only bearable when you know what's going on. Okay, yeah, yeah. So, like, real life math is not hard at all, and I could actually listen to somebody do real life math, right? Or, like, business math, I could probably listen to. Um, oh wait, you want, you want me to send you the rules is what you're saying? But if somebody's just sitting there and trying to like explain to me why there's a lot, like why there should be letters in my math equation, I'm, I start to get a little angry. You just failed the driving test? No, Nez, what happened? Oh no, send me the ladder. Okay, I got you. How did you fail your driver's test? What did you do? I, bro, my driver's test was so easy. This lady had to be at least like 70 years old and like she'd owned the business for a long time. Dude the cars were nice right and i drove for probably like four minutes and she gave me my license you know what i mean so probably from the fact that she couldn't see she said she forgot her glasses um and dude she was squinting out the window she probably couldn't tell if i was running red lights or stop signs she would just look over and say you're doing great you know what i mean that was my old lady impression sorry chat oh uh, yeah dude she had no clue what was going on she kind of sounded like the kellogg's commercial uh like mike the tiger anyway is it mike Wait, what is the tiger's name? Tony the Tiger? Something like that. Anyways, bro, she was a grandma, dog. Like, she had grandchildren for sure. At least six of them. And uh, she had, like, her... like That was her lock screen on her phone. Anyways, she was not paying attention. Got my driver's license in four minutes. Uh, hopefully, she doesn't see this video because she's going to be like, Meh. Uh, How did you... No, wait. I didn't have to parallel park. And my driver's test did not have to parallel park. Did you guys? You had to parallel park? Producer says that they had to parallel park. That is awful. Okay. I apologize, chat. That's kind of tough. I didn't even have to park. But, bro, I just stopped the car in the middle of this driving school. Like, the parking lot of the driving school, I didn't even park the car. Dog, I was just chilling. Oh, dude, y'all got kind of unlucky, dude. That's tough. Um, We don't have to parallel park anymore. I have to. You must have gotten lucky, LMAO. Yeah, you got to choose the driving school that looks the oldest. You know what I mean? Or like, maybe a little bit run down. Like, people that own it probably don't care too much. Right, like they get a little bit of that money on the side to just like start giving out driver's license and causing crashes and such. Um, 
I have, a par- I have to parallel park, bro. I don't know how to. Bro, you could learn how to parallel park so easily. Set two cones. Buy two cones. How much is an orange cone on the internet, chat? How much is an orange cone? Buy two cones for like 10 bucks. Set a cone right here. Set a cone right here. Boom. Park between it. You hit the cone. Oh, no. I hit the cone. What? You don't hit the cone. Oh, my God. I'm going to pass my driver's test. Bro, what? Uh, the person that was instructing me was a middle-aged woman, and she looked smart. You know how you can tell someone smart, bro? Oh, that's kind of like the same way I said that you can tell if somebody can cook or not. Like, bro, you can tell if somebody's smart or not. You know what I mean? Like, did she have glasses on? Probably the first indicator I would look for, right? You know what I mean? Usually people that can't see, they make up for it in their smarts. You know what I mean? Like, they don't have it visually, so they have it mentally. <laughs> Come on. No, that's not a shot at people that can't see. You know what I mean? It's like, you're still a great person, but you got you to gotta get your eyes checked. You know what I mean? You can't even fight me without tossing on the spectacles first. You know what I mean? And once I take them off your head and hit you with them, you're just done. You know what I mean? It's over. And you probably can't parallel park, to be honest. But anyways, uh, guys, listen. I support people that have glasses. I have glasses. Don't wear them because I'm a baller. Uh, yeah, don't wear If you have glasses, don't even wear them unless you're a loser. Anyways. Uh, I think in my state, they don't enforce the parallel parking. Oh, wait, Hunter Davis, that's probably why I didn't have to parallel park either. Yeah, Louisiana might not even have to. Wait, my bad. I have glasses, but I don't wear them because I'm not a nerd. Facts, bro. Imagine wearing glasses when you're supposed to. Wait, that, that's probably terrible advice. You, may, you should just wear your glasses, right? Visual, like, visualizing the world is very important. You know what? I'm condu- You go get your eyes checked today. You need to wear your glasses. Me? I'm still going to be a baller. Oh, I'm not a nerd. Don't be a nerd, though. Anyways, Hunter Davis, do you wear glasses? Can you wear glasses in the NFL? Like, how would you wear goggles, like, while you're playing? That would be awful. And what if they break them? Somebody tackles you a little bit? I have contacts? Dude, I feel so bad for you. Putting in contacts has got to be hard. Like, I think when I was a kid, bro, like, one of my friends had, like, these colored contacts, and he was like, oh, bro, try this. Couldn't put it in. They laughed at me for hours. It's not that easy, bro contact lens yeah i wouldn't even try it honestly imagine your contact slips behind your behind your eye is that possible no i don't think you could slip your contact behind your eye i would kind of get a little stressed out about that though but uh good thing i don't wear them i got used to it over time yeah and you can't sleep with them i'm pretty sure huh like it dries out your eye maybe uh, anyways uh you still wear glasses during football my contact did slip behind my eye no you're lying slip behind your eye no Chat, I'm gonna get a sip of water. Uh, y'all, y'all talk amongst yourselves. <laughs> oh yeah. Mm. I feel like a comedian on the stage. You know what I mean? Like they take the little sips of water. I feel like my throat gets so dry so quick. Uh, but it comes out like the next day still bro like imagine if you knew something was behind your eye like even if it was like just like a breadcrumb you know what i mean like that would terrify me um on everything my mom and dad had to dig it out bro don't say dig how can you dig something out of your eye bro that's not possible did you just like blink a bunch of times y'all ever get something in your eye or like whenever you're in the shower like you get soap in your eye because you're like trying to look around while you're showering like, sometimes where I'll be hearing some crazy noises, and, like, like the second the water and the soap start to get in my eye, I'm starting to hear some crazy-ass noises, and I want to look around, but I can't. So, like, I'm rushing to, like, wash my eye out, and I can't see anything, and it starts to sting. And you try to dig it out. Anyways, there's a barrier that stops it from getting to your brain. Okay, that's probably good. You capping? Yeah, that's cap, bro. Straight cap. I would rather not see than wear contact lenses. There's just no chance that that's true. Um, I hope that, that you have to have that test in your life now because you just spoke that into the world. You would rather not be able to see than wear a contact lens. I mean, I don't, I feel like, of course you get, you get used to it over time, but like not be able to see, like that would affect you very heavily unless you've always had a problem with your hearing. Like I hear if you can't see anything, like your other senses get heightened or if like you can't smell anything, your other senses get heightened. You know what I mean? Like your ability to like hear dogs barking gets really like gets way better if you can't smell stuff. <laughs> yeah, I don't need eyes. Me neither. Honestly, yeah. I might be fine with like walking to school, like, you know, scraping the ground with my stick. I wouldn't mind it. You know what I mean? Anyways, chat. Wait, where, what are we talking about right now, bro? Uh, how's everybody doing? Like the video if you're in here right now. I'd really, 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 really appreciate it. That'd be awesome. I'd rather be blind than deaf. No, 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 no. I'd rather be deaf. Wait. I don't know which one would honestly like make me feel worse about like, I don't know, man. 
when you become deaf, you most likely become mute. Not if you're like becoming deaf at like an, an older age. Like obviously, if you're becoming deaf at like child, like at birth, then yeah, you're gonna be a mute because you won't know how to say things. Eight likes, you guys. Eight likes. Let's see more of that. Okay. Yeah, I don't want to be deaf or mute or blind, so I'm not even gonna speak that into the world. Chat. I didn't even ask you guys how your day was. Listen, one out of ten. Let me know how your day was. I really appreciate it. Um. Also, if you're still in here, let me get a one spam just to make sure that we know who the real fans are and who is actually supporting us at this very moment, okay? I'll wait. Listen, I'm fine with waiting. 9 out of 10, okay, pretty good, pretty good. Hunter Davis and Nizuko, always on top with the dedication and the streams. We got eight people in here. Best been ever. Shout out to you, bud. I really appreciate it. Let's go. Moon is in here as well. Okay, okay. Jujubee is in here as well. You guys, y'all are my uh, y'all are my day ones. You know, I mean, number one fans. Really appreciate you, everybody that is in here right now. You are the people that I'm gonna say uh, that I really want to thank you guys just for showing up today. Uh, I know I do this every day, but listen, every single day that you guys add meaning to my life, I wake up every day and I know I have to stream and I do it for you. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of sad that there's not gonna be 